We've got some hot days ahead of us this week, and that means your kids will be melting, most likely outside at summer camp. Denver 7's Connor Wish shares what you can do at home to make sure they are prepared to be out in the heat. It's burning. I'm sweating so much. Colorado is turning up the heat. For these soccer players, a little shade and a lot of Gatorade and water go a long way. During the day, how many times do you make sure that you stop and get water and stay hydrated? Like, all the time. 20 times. That's a lot. <laughs> Dumping water on my head. Drinking drink tons of water. water. Drink a lot of water. As an athlete, hydration is key throughout the day, especially on hot summer days. Hydration doesn't start or end at camp. It pretty much starts the day before camp. Children's Hospital Colorado recommends athletes start hydrating at least four hours before play. Every 15 to 30 minutes during practice, and it doesn't stop there. After camp, have to be hydrated. Before camp, they need to hydrate. So the parents need to be involved in that. Otherwise, it's going to be a problem throughout the day. When the proper steps aren't taken, your kids could be putting themselves and their time at camp on hold. If they come up and their stomach's upset, we try to figure out, get a history of what they had for breakfast, if they had breakfast. If not, maybe sneak into their lunchbox and get them something to eat. Usually, if we get them out of, this, out of the sun and into the shade and get them some water and an ice bag on their head and cool them down a little bit, they feel a lot better. In Centennial, Connor Wist, Denver 7. Now, if you need some ideas on snacks to keep your kids going during summer camps, we've got a list on our free Denver 7 app.